Hello, this is Andy from Walt Motor Company in Newbury and welcome to the sale of this 2014 14 registered Land Rover Freelander. So a bit special this car, kind of getting to quite right to the end of the run with this model. It's the HSE, um, finished in chorus grey with beige leather interior. This car's only covered 47,000 miles, has a lovely service history including the cam belt change. Um, and an MOT till 2025. The advisory at the MOT was four tyres, so the gentleman changed all four tyres. It's been so well kept. You just come in across these cars now and again, and you know, you know, when they've got the door edge protection on it, when they got the proper rubber over mats, the window deflectors as well, you know, it couldn't have been more well maintained, this car. So, First of all, the mileage, of course, 47,000 miles, mega, mega low. Drives all as it should, in really nice condition all the way around. Some slight deterioration to the front grille. One or two little marks on the wheels, and that really is pretty much it. Really, really nice example. So let's have a closer look round. Driver's door card in excellent condition. Got the black wood finish as well. Meridian sound in this car four electric windows and electric mirrors electric memory driver's seat you can see the seat itself the bolster in excellent condition got the big double sunroofs and this one does have a leather steering wheel steering wheel itself is in excellent condition all the way around on the left hand side of the wheel you get your cruise control on the right hand side telephony and this one does have a heated steering wheel. Looking down to the mileage on the dash there, it's currently 47438. You just don't find them with this sort of mileage, do you? Let me pull in my long leg, start the car up. Still got to go through the workshop, this one, but you'll see no warning lights on the dash, it shouldn't be there. Loads of diesel in it as well for somebody, which is good news. Across to the infotainment, obviously touch screen on the nav, might just take a second, there we are. Colour navigation, you've obviously got telephony and radio with digital radio as well, although we're inside. If I pop the car in reverse, you'll see she's got the parking sensors. And then moving down, there's your controls for it, your radio and CD player. Oh, the CD player goes in there. Heated seats in the front. Command shift style gearbox. Two keys with keyless go. And then the armrests here. All in very good order, as is the passenger seat. And the passenger door card. The dashboard, all the plastics you come into contact with. Very clean and tidy. Driver's side rear door card, again in excellent condition. And as we look into the back seats, absolutely lovely. Head restraints are present. Another look at the roofs. Backs of the front seats in good order. And proper Land Rover rubber over mats as well. Into the boot area. Again, nice and tidy. Plastic's in good condition. Hasn't had a hard life, this car. Full-size spare wheel. Load cover present. You probably noticed it's got a little tow bar there just for a garden trailer or maybe a bike rack. All in nice clean condition in the back. Starting away around the bodywork near side front corner. All in good condition. Like I said, very recent tyres. Good years all round. Near side front Alloy wheel has very minor scuffing. And looking along the passenger side of the car, including the mirror cap, can't see any, any obvious dinks, dents or scratches. Got privacy glass, obviously. Offside rear wheel, sorry, near side rear wheel. Very good. Around this side of the bumper's all nice. Across the back edge, got a protection strip on the top. All cool, offside rear wheel, 
perfect. And then along the driver's side, again, no obvious dinks, dents or scratches. Mirror cap's fine. And then offside front wheel, perfect. Round the front, this corner's all good. Like I said, minor deterioration to the grill. It can be replaced. Up onto the bonnet, a couple of little stone chips to be expected. A little bit of road rash up on the windscreen, every car has it. Gentleman's left the uh, forward camera in there as well. Up on the roof as well, there we go. Really, really nice car. So there we go. I don't want to overdo it, but the, you know, the chap that, that traded this car in, he bought a Discovery 4. He needed it for towing a caravan in the end. Um, he, he couldn't have been nicer. Couldn't have been a more proper chap. So the car's been very, very well looked after. Like I said, history is correct and good. Nice spec car, right colour scheme. And as I often say in these videos, they're not making any more of them, are they? So, so find another one with this sort of low mileage. Makes it quite a rare beast. If you'd like to come and see the car, it's in Newbury and Berkshire. Do give me a ring. My name's Andy on 07786 742 422. Thanks for watching the videos. Do like and subscribe.